Payments to Ross Tech are manually processed, generally by the end of the following business day. As such, plan ahead on doing a VIN upgrade. Do not wait until the day of. Registered Ross Tech customers with a HEX device that has a 3 VIN limit can upgrade to a 10 VIN limit. And registered Ross Tech customers with a HEX device that has a 10 VIN limit can upgrade to unlimited VINs. Details about VIN limits can be found on our Benevolent Dictators FAQ forum post, link in the description below. To purchase a VIN upgrade, go to the Ross Tech website, www.ross-tech.com. In the light blue bar at the top of the page, click on the Upgrades link. On the next page, go down to option number 5 and click on I want to add VIN licenses. You will need to copy and paste the long serial number from the VCDS About screen into this field. If you are unsure how to do this, click on the About screen and VCDS software link for details. With the long serial number pasted into the field, make sure the quantity is set to 1 and then click Add to Cart. Now proceed to checkout. Check the box to agree to the terms and conditions and fill out the required information and then place order at the bottom of the page. You will receive a generated email with your order number. With that, your order is in queue to be processed again generally by the end of the following business day. Once your order is processed and payment verified, you will receive a second email with a feature code to upgrade your HEX device. A feature code is only good for five days. After that, it will expire and no longer work. With your laptop computer connected to the internet, plug your HEX device up to the computer using the USB cord. From the first screen of VCDS, go to Options, then click on Config to open the VCDS Interface Config Utility. First, go to the Update tab and check for updates. If there are updates found, then download them before you do the VIN upgrade. Once your HEX device is up to date, click on the Advanced tab and input your feature code here. Then click Check Feature Update. Once the VIN upgrade is complete, you will get a pop-up message confirming the upgrade. You can now exit out of the VCDS Interface Config Utility. On the Program Options screen of VCDS, click on Test and then verify your VIN limit status has been updated.